What's inside our new chicken processing workshop? Chicken processing step-by-step -step guide. That is color, photos, step-by-step -step of the process. This is intended to be like a manual to have it with you on hand and guide you through the entire process so you won't forget anything. Uh, we first opened our workshop and our new community in January and now we're opening it up again because it is chicken season. The grass is growing more every day and we're gonna be moving out these meat chickens we just got in a few weeks already and then in 12 weeks we're gonna have a freezer full of chicken. And that's why we made this course. We made it so that way you can have access to it on your phone. It's an app. We got Derek showing his new brooder. <laughs> it's awesome, man. Access to courses on your phone where it has the, all the levels of chicken processing. And you know, we plan on doing more workshops. I'm already in the works of creating more content on this and creating more workshops. We have recipes, how to cook a whole chicken, how to make bone broth, how to make sunshine broth, how to spatchcock a chicken. And these are written out PDF recipes that Lorraine worked on and they are part of the course as well. How to cook chicken liver chili cheese fries. Don't knock it till you try it. And 10% off McMurray Hatchery chickens, meat chickens, not just Cornish crosses, but, but also our favorite Murray's Big Red Broilers. Start your day, start your working. And also 12 original content, 12 videos, separate videos such as like troubleshooting tips. Certain things happen on butchering day, you know, that's kind of weird or maybe not common. And we just kind of go through that there because these are things that we've experienced as well. We go over freezers, how big of a freezer do you need? We go over what to do with the feathers, the, the blood, uh, the innards, um, how to bag a chicken two different ways, quality control, the cleanup after butchering, all the tools needed and necessary on butchering day. We have them all here in our course. And also our cone setup here. I have plans for this too because we don't have a, a, a old barn that we that we use or a tree, so I needed something to set up these cones. And so we have plans in there in our workshop. Also, because I know some of you guys are messaging me and they, you wanted to be part of the community aspect of it because we started our own private community group, not on any social media platform. Uh, it's our own, so there's no algorithms, there's no ads, there's no distractions. You know, it's just our own community group. And so we open that part up as well. If you do not want the workshop and you only want the community group, we have an option for that now. So I'll leave a link down below, guys. We are incredibly excited about this workshop. I mean, we've been working on this thing all last winter. And I know a lot more of you, a lot more of you, because I know because you messaged me, <laughs> wanting to know how to take your backyard raised chicken to your dinner table to feed your family. And this workshop is meant to give you guys confidence to do that. When you sign up for the workshop, you also have access to the community, which means you also have access to me where you can specifically message us. You can, we can answer all your questions uh, that you might have. Um, and also you could meet other like-minded people in the community. You have this step-by-step -step guide. You can have it on your phone. You can print it out. You can bind it. Uh, have it be a guide, a reference guide to the videos that we have on here also. So this is your friendly reminder, guys, that the card is open for chicken butchering workshops. We got two different levels. Plus, if you just want the community, we have that as well. Just your friendly reminder to let you know that these things are available and this is what we offer. I appreciate it, thank you. Let's have an awesome year of getting to that next level of raising more chickens, maybe starting to raise your own meat chickens, maybe raise more meat chickens, because last year was our first time that we did that. We usually just did about 60 a year, but last year we did 120. And we're looking to do that same again, maybe even more. So, incredibly excited about this, guys. Um, it's going to be a good year. Check the description, check the link in the show notes. Um, I hope to see you guys there.